see what my FPS is. But I went through already and I set up all of my graphic settings for the game, including uh, field of view. I set it up to 100 like it was in the last game. But every graphic setting except for motion blur has been turned up to ultra nightmare max graphic settings because motion blur can eat a dick. And now we've got a uh, film grain set to zero. Resolution scaling mode is actually set to dynamic. And you know, in case the game were to ever slow down, which I don't think it ever will, but it's time for us to go ahead and get started. Are you guys ready for the doom? My hair is not. Honestly, I don't care. Let's have fun. Actually, did I get everything else? Headphones. Subtitles are on. Let's do it. Yep. Because motion blur can eat a dick. Uh, if you die in the campaign is over and your death mark will be uh, extra life mode. Extra life mode is a special campaign mode for players looking for an old school experience. Run out of extra lives and then die. It's game over. Oh, I get it. It's like a, it's like playing Sonic. I got you. What do you guys think? Difficulty. I'm not going ultra nightmare. Hear me plenty. Thank you for being so nice, Anon. I really appreciate that. Most people usually go straight to Nightmare or Ultra Nightmare and really try to troll the crap out of me. You're the only one going with a normal difficulty. Good for you, sir. I'm going Ultra, ni ultra Violence. <laughs> ultra Nightmare. <laughs> Press space to continue. All right, here we go, guys. Like I usually do, I'll get my cam out of the way in between. Give me one quick second. One last thing I got to do with the camera or else we're going to have issues. I got to set the camera to not deactivate when I'm not showing. Okay. God, my hair is rough. <laughs> my hair looks so rough on stream. That's a good way to look at it, Anon. All right, here we go, guys. I'm going to be able to switch in between to cam and no cam, so it'll switch back and forth seamlessly. So if there's things going on, we'll see. Here we go. Against all the evil that hell can conjure, all the wickedness that mankind can produce, we will send unto them only you. Rip and tear. Rip and tear until it is done. This is all in engine too. This is not a pre-recorded scene. This is pretty cool. Doom. Here we go. Get excited, chat. Get your hands up. It's doom time. Maybe on is alive. Looks like it's hell on earth, guys. Literally doom too. Got his mask off. Uh oh. Attempting to acquire the Hell Priest signal. Another Vega? Nearly 60% of our planet has been consumed by the invaders. We have the Hell Priest signal locked in. The target is marked, but the signal will not hold for long. For it is he that they fear, not man. For his armies, they fear the mark of the beast.
<laughs> oh, we're in, boys. Uh, let me do one thing really fast. I'm going to move my camera. Heck yeah. What's up, Alexic? How you doing? Let me, uh, I want to move myself over here so you guys can see my health bars and stuff, so should be good to go. Wow, that was easy. Where did I spawn? The game's trying to explain gory kills. I gotcha. E. Ah, nice. Hold on one second. Sensitivity's got to go way up. Go up to like eight. That's much better. C to instantly chainsaw demons and refill your ammo. The chainsaw requires fuel, gas canister, fuel pickups, all that stuff. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Instantly. Targets. Whee. Wait, so I don't even have to pull the chainsaw out separately as its own weapon. I just press C. Chainsaw. Yes. I love it. All of a sudden, chainsaw. I'm trying to, you know, it looks like I got three marks, so. Do I jump and hit it? Oh, punch it. Oh, okay. Double jump. Press uh, space to jump in the air and press space again in the air to double jump. Yep. It's all tutorial section. Yep, I remember these. These are weapon mod selections and stuff like that. Uh, weapon mod selection screen, interact with a mod bot, and then unlock a mod for available weapon. Use mods to expand each weapon's gameplay behavior. Sticky bombs or full auto. I love these preview videos. Look at that. I've had the sticky bombs before, but that full auto looks freaking menacing. Look at the look at the giblets going everywhere. I'm gonna go with the sticky bombs, but the full auto looks menacing as hell, dude. Sticky bombs. By the way, the FPS is absolutely insane. You guys see my frames per second in the top right? Oh my gosh, this game flies on my computer. Murder. It takes, oh, I can shoot up to three of them, but they have to charge if I use them all. I gotcha. <laughs> right through him. Oh my gosh, we got we got like regular marines. We have we didn't even have these in the other one. Oh, we sort of did, but not exactly like that. Neat. Chainsaw. And chainsaw. He went through. Oh my gosh, he went down the long ways of his arm. He went long ways on his arm. Oh my gosh, that, that's, that's just terrible. Uh -huh. Get to dig Nilox's chamber. Okay, I got you. 
Yeah, I'm loving it too, man. It's really good so far. Beautiful. Super smooth as well, by the way. No lag. Yeah, we took we took his priest has been terminated. Whoa, okay. Reduced by 36.8%. There are two hell priests remaining. Yeah, it's just normal. That happens every day. I mean, you know. <laughs> it's showing off like crazy right now, dude. Oh my gosh, look at this entire environment and everything, guys. Oh, this is great. This is absolutely amazing so far. What was that? Remaining human populations are one. Okay. Um, okay, so we already got sticky bombs. We'll unlock the full auto then. Do I have another gun or just a combat shot? Don't you know Bob? Bob! Dang it. Okay, press F to swap what mods. <laughs> Kako Demon. Doom Blade, Chainsaw. Do I have any other guns? That was all I got so far? Yeah, that's all I got is a combat shotty. I don't have any guns, not even a pistol. I'm gonna take a take a little bit of time and look around, guys. I hope you don't mind. I mean, just this game is beautiful. Hey, no spoilers. Period. No spoilers. Purge all spoilers, please. Zero spoilers. I don't want anything to ruin this playthrough. We're going to be playing it for 12 hours tomorrow, and I want to have a great time. You know what I mean? <laughs> Box. Oh, that's how I get my uh, objective to pop up. Okay. I just want to see how many punches it takes. It, it takes more than just one this time. The demons in the original game were, well, in 2016 were so much easier to kill. They were one punch all the time. These are not. Okay. When you shoot them, you blow off parts, and sometimes they'll just explode into pieces like that. You can literally see pieces and parts of enemies just flying off of them while you're shooting them. Oh, nice. I didn't know you went to the Olympics. Uh, weak points. Uh, certain teams have weak points that we can shop for extra damage or even disable their abilities. Uh, weak points slash red when damaged. Uh, Arcanotron. Kind of trying. Arknatran. Okay, I forgot the name. That's, that was in Doom 2, so. It's a heavy range demon. Its turret is a weak point and can be destroyed. Disable in its long range attacks. Explore the codex to learn more about the demon weak points. Okay. Oh, there's a target, just not enough. I'm out of ammo. 
I see, okay. I'm out of ammo! I made mistakes! Lots of mistakes. There we go, gas. Now I got ammo. Oh, come on, dude. I was so close. Dang it. I messed up. Try again. It loads super fast, too. Super fast. Let's try this again without dying. And running out of ammo. Unable to contact game services. Looks like everybody's getting online. Online rewards, XP, and other online progress will not be saved, and online futures will be unavailable until the game returns online. That's fine. Let me play. Steam servers just went down. Oh, no. Uh, in the eye. Get wrecked. Oh god, that looks horrible. Me. New gun. I need ammo. That chainsaw was having a hard time getting through him. Bam. 100 health, 25 armor. Nice. I don't care if uh, online services in this game go on go offline. I honestly am not. I don't care about the multiplayer. Who could uh, could you see anybody being like, oh man, I bought Doom. I bought Doom Eternal for the for the for the multiplayer, not for the campaign. No. Quickly swap to your previous weapons. Oh, I see. Okay. I have that one, one guy that's like, I bought it for the, you know, I bought it for the multiplayer. I'm like, are you kidding me? What's this? Is this a map? Yep, auto map station. That's what it is. Find an auto map station will reveal all undiscovered areas. You can view the map in the map tab with hit and tab. Okay. Easy enough to get around. Easy enough to see where you've been. Neat. Oh, I missed a secret back there. I want to go find out what that is really fast. Can I go back? I'll just... I'm, I was holding tab. I'm used to it. My bad. Oh shoot, I don't think I can. It might be too high up. Come on, let me back up. I'm almost there. Ah, oh, I got it. Nice. Glitched. Up there on the right, it looks like there's something. Service. Can't get up there, can I? 
Nope, I can't get back up there. I'm screwed. Wish I knew about that ahead of time. I would have done it. Dang, oh well. Whee! continue. music rock. I need ammo. Oh, don't worry about it, Quavion. It's actually been really good. Well, actually, I will say up and down. I had some issues with the Beat Saber, but now we're back over on Doom, so I'm happy. I had... It took me like a half an hour to get the mods installed properly. I had to, like, reinstall the entire game because something was corrupted and none of my mods would show up. Or the host TK when I want to ban him. I don't know. He hasn't been around here long. I see. Nah, it happens though. I'm not worried about it. I'm here to have fun and have a good time. Got to keep that positivity up, you know. Things happen. Don't worry about it. You know, just work around it, fix the problem, and keep on. Oh, I made a very sizable golf ring to the blood god. That was great. is extremely smooth. I get no lag at all. It's up here first. There's like a question mark up here somewhere. Not in there. Oh, I, you know what? I passed by this earlier and it was closed. Probably, if it's anything like the other game, there's probably a switch somewhere, you know? big fat lever that you're supposed to pull and it takes you where you're supposed to go.
Yeah, that just happens every day. Yeah, I don't mind him. Yeah, he's just settling in Timid's new apartment. I mean, he's literally carrying it on his back. Actually, no, that's your new mansion. No worries. Okay. Something over here. Oh, it's a one-up. Wait, I have lives? Are you serious? They have one-ups in this game? <laughs> There's gotta be a switch or something somewhere. Nah, uh, if it was Tim and Angry, you wouldn't be alive. Uh, down below and to the left. Okay, apparently I'm not supposed to go that way. came from. Okay, we're fighting over here. I see a break of a wall. I can drop down into the room. Secret found. Hey, the little imps. I found an imp toy. Nice. That's pretty cool. So there's probably a way up or down that allows me to be able to break into the wall and be able to find where I'm going. So just this. Oh. Oh! Neat. Extra lives. Let me read this. Extra lives immediately revive you if you run out of health. Once you run out of extra lives, leaving all your health will send you back to the last checkpoint. Oh, that makes sense now. Okay. Extra life. pop up in the top left. I just noticed that. Okay. Yep, more collectibles. Uh, hey, Timid, he's moving your apart. He's moving your mansion to the wrong place. You gonna talk to him? You might want to talk to the movers. I think they're doing something wrong. He's supposed to go over there. Why is it going that way? What was the name of the movie with the... I'm, I'm blanking out right now. What's the name of the movie with the giant robots? You have to have two people on the inside in order to be able to control it so they sink their mind and they fight against giant, uh... Like, Godzilla-looking creatures. What's that called again? I can't remember. Yeah, Pacific Rim. That's what it was. That's what that reminds me of. Oh, I can grapple. Can attach the pit walls by pressing E or mouse full or climb by pressing WSAD. Then look around to climb to another location. Anywhere else to go? No.
I got a yellow key card. Uh oh. Bam. So, you know, the entire place is destroyed and everything, but yeah, uh, this door's electricity still works, including some lights. That's all I'm gonna do every time. Go right through him. UAC, you're crazy. Thanks to the UAC Hell Merger Initiative, humanity can now reach its full potential. First thing I do if I find any uh, Argen cores or anything or whatever the upgrades are in this game, I am going to get ammo upgrades pronto. I need more ammo. Oh, subway. Tentacles! The Kraken has taken over the train. Precision bolt or micro missiles? Precision bolt, let me see. Yes, precision bolt. Yes. I didn't like the micro missiles so much in the first game. Frag grenade, press left control or mouse three to launch a grenade. Left control? I'm gonna switch it to G, which explodes after landing on the ground. Okay. Controls. Where's remapping controls? Custom Slayer bindings. Okay, there we go. The Doom Slayer. Uh, Crucible V. I got you. Okay, Q. G is switch equipment. No, I'll make that H. <clears throat> There's a grenade. Equipment launcher. G. Okay. I don't use middle mouse button. I feel like it's just too heavy to push. I've always felt like it's too heavy to push. Like it's just not, my fingers are not made for something like that, you know? <laughs> Kako Demon is a pressure demon with a, po a powerful close range bite. If you can fire a sticky bomb or frag grenade into its mouth, it instantly staggers. Neat.
Freaking stuck his uh, he stuck his knife into its eye and pulled it out of its socket. Nice. nice when they stood still for me yeah i heard the pop i heard it it was cool Out of fuel. Grenade. I need to use a grenade. Another one. Into the eye. <laughs> I might adjust the brightness a little bit. I feel like for this game, it might be a, a hair too bright, not not enough darkness. You know what I mean? So let me do that really fast, guys, and see if I can adjust that brightness really fast. Video enable HDR. I'm gonna have to mess with that off stream. Gamma. Let me see. Okay. Oh, you guys can't see it at all. I shouldn't even adjust it. Blue drop brightness. Nah, it doesn't bother me. Well, there's a lot of extra lighting in here and stuff like that, you know, on the inside of the building. So, hey guys, it's Ed 209. Is there a secret down here? I kind I kind of I kind of agree with you guys when it comes to the looks. I kind of like the uh, the other one a little more, but I say when it comes down to like detail for things off in the distance and stuff like that, they absolutely nailed it. But we'll see if it gets darker later. Maybe this is just a certain map where it's like too bright, you know. Hey guys, the game wants you to suffer. I'm not gonna try, I'll end up falling. I, I wasn't gonna try for it because I felt like I was gonna fall off the map. We've 
gun full, uh, full Tomb Raider boys. We're jumping and grabbing on everything. How many punches does it take to get to the center of a demon? The world is about to find out. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And apparently it doesn't work. There we go. The tentacle. It's literally called tentacle. I mean, it's an OG Doomer. I like this look. It's not too over the top. Well, yeah, I mean... Uh, I've played all the original games. That was literally my high school. I think it looks absolutely beautiful, but I still think it's a little too bright. But you know what? We'll see when we get farther in if it changes. Oh, tentacle! Did I just find a secret? I did! Cheat code found, infinite lives. Cheat codes allow you to replay missions through mission select with special modifiers. Playing with cheat codes does not disable progression. Replay missions to find missing items, win additional combat encounters, and experiment with locked weapons or upgrades. That's hilarious, it's a floppy disk. That's awesome. Oh, go back down, thank you. That's cool. I like that. I like that little touch there. Oh, God. You didn't give him a chance, man. Get aboard the Citadel. I think we're about to do something crazy, man. Glory kills are just as satisfying as they were in the first game. That was a pretty cool glory kill, man. He chopped his entire upper back in half. That was so cool. So just like the first game, depending on the position of the uh, of when you do the glory kill is what is, shows what it's gonna do to the enemy. <laughs> Twist his head in half. Here we go. We try. Oh, dang. Should have died, man. Let's try it aside. Yep, I've done that one. Let me try the left side next time. If 
Why do they explode without an eye? I don't know. Just go with it. There's a one up in here. There's a way up there. far of a jump, apparently. Big body armor. Uh, okay. Already got everything downstairs. Looks like we're okay. There's a lot of items to find on these maps now. Nice. Why not just let them fight and kill one another? Or do they not kill one another? This music right now, the way it's kicking on. Oh, heck yeah, Four Star, I understand all that. Um, this music reminds me of something I'd hear from Mad Max Fury Road. Lost a life. Extra life activated. Citadel. I will mark her location on your HUD. That is freaking cool. You know what that reminds me of? <laughs> Little Nicky. You remember at the end of the movie where he's zooming in on the two guys that went to hell and they're rocking out in hell? That literally reminds me of the building that they were in. <laughs> it works. Inspired by Little Nikki. The gathering of hell priests is located just above your location. My scans indicate there is a lift at the center of this facility. Okay, I'd like some questions answered. What happened to Samuel Hayden? How did all these... music right now is just like shoot what the hell I just get myself into I could easily fit through that come on
fast travel. Fast travel allows you to teleport to predetermined points in the map. Use it to find additional items and complete optional encounters. Fast travel unlocks near the end of a mission. Oh, okay. So what, now I can fast travel somewhere? F, show fast travel. Barge, city, citadel. Okay. I got you. All right. So if the maps are too long and you want to backtrack and find some items you missed, you could do that. That's not a bad idea. Can't press F to fast. I've been doing that forever, though. Dang it, fasting. I'm just looking around. Just like in the other game. The con maker is present at this gathering, but when outside of her domain, she is by all accounts indestructible. The Doomslayer. How can this be? No man can pass through the gate. It is... This stops nothing. The sacrament of this world to the great Khan Maker will be made. And the energy will be restored once again. As it is written, from the souls of the non-believers! You will not save them from their judgment. <laughs> you go too far this time. You cannot interfere. This is humanity's chance to repent. To give service to us. You cannot resist the will of the Khan Maker. Activating the portal now. For it was you who was meant to enforce it. So wait, the Doom guy was the one that was supposed to uh, enforce basically hell taking over the world. And now that hell is being taken over by the world, he's like, nope, change plans. Hmm. Uh, enter, hold to continue, or escape, save, and exit. Hmm. Exploration. I found a lot of items. I'm missing two other toys and a codex. Okay, so I got all the mod bots, though. And rewards. Uh, nothing because I'm not playing online. Let's go. Fortress of Doom. Cheat code. Progression tips. Playing with cheat codes. Da, 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 da. I gotcha. Does not disable progression, allowing them to complete aspects of all missions. Okay. Let's continue on. I do not have the means to locate the second hell priest. Your celestial locator is missing a component. We will need a replacement. I've completed the redesign of your equipment launcher. The flame belch is now ready for your approval. Flame belch? Acquire the flame belch. <laughs> <laughs> Fire and flames. There you go. More tutorials. Okay, press R to set enemies on fire and they will drop uh, armor shards. Kill them and they will drop the most armor. Oh, I see, okay. Flame belch demons in groups to maximize the number of shards dropped. 
I see, okay. Contain 50 on it. Yeah, pretty much. Obtain a sentinel crystal. Okay. Is this this is pretty much our just like it was at the beginning of the game when they were trying to show the, the home world at which we live on. We live on some kind of space station floating above Earth. And he this is pretty much his hub to come back and forth in between places. Sentinel crystal tutorial. This is Sentinel Crystal selection screen. Use a Sentinel Crystal to permanently upgrade your health, armor, or ammo cap capacities. Yes. You can select an upgrade to increase your health, ammo, or armor capacity. There are four upgrades available for each category. When selecting an upgrade, the selection shows your currently upgraded uh, capacities. Select upgrade will increase that category. Um, unlocking two linked upgrades can give you a bonus upgrade. Consider the bonus upgrade when selecting your Sentinel Crystal upgrades. Okay, first off, number one, I want to do, I do not want to do health. Oh, I see. Okay. We'll do ammo. Napalm belge. Heavy and super heavy demons stay on fire longer. Uh, demons drop armor at a faster rate. Okay. As long as you're at max armor, all armor pickups contribute to blood punch. Blood punch. Okay. Yeah, I think roasted demon is actually really good for your health. Uh, you know, it's like char on a hot dog. It's not too bad. It kind of messes up the taste a little bit, but it's still all right. All right. Resource drops get pulled in from much further away. Yes. What's the other one? Sentinel crystals are immediately applied along with unlock bonus upgrades. Oh, shoot. B goody with the hoodie coming in for 31 months. Why did that show up in the chat, though? Is my chat broken or something? I'm going to reset my chat. I actually refresh it entirely. It's just being weird. There we go. All right. Yeah, I know. 31 months. 31. It's a lot of time, man. But thank you so much. Can I please get some hands up in the air and show some love to be goody guys? With that hoodie. Is that crystal meth? Maybe. Who's asking? Are you wanting some? No, you can't have any. It's mine. 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 There you go. Search the environment to locate more sentinel crystals and improve your capabilities. Okay. Oh, activated and ready when you are. Uh, mission select. I gotcha. Mission select allows you to revisit completed missions to find items and complete encounters you may have missed. Cheat codes found in levels can only be activated through mission select. Hell on Earth figures. Doom 2 was called Hell on Earth, and that's the name of the first map. Arc update available. What's this? This is an Arc broadcast. There are reports coming out of the quarantined Hellified zone near the San Andreas Chasm. Satellite imagery show what ARC personnel believe to be the legendary Doomslayer himself fighting the mortally challenged. The Doomslayer, or Doomguy, as he is sometimes referred to, yep. was thought to be a myth of the Resistance, a sort of avenging angel. He was last reported to be seen on Mars and is allegedly responsible for the destruction of the Argent Tower there. He disappeared soon afterwards. The UAC continues to deny all reports of his existence. We will continue to broadcast new information as we receive it. You know, I'm going to, if there's any updates, I'm going to be listening to these like as often as I can. Get all the information we can about uh, the story in the background and get, get an understanding of the character. Yeah, mortally challenged. 
Exaltia. Uh, to put an end to the demonic consumption of Earth, the Hell Priest must be eliminated. Following the death of D. Nilox, that's the first guy, the two, the remaining two Hell Priests have gone missing. You must return to Exaltia, forsaken city of Sentinel Pass, to acquire the device necessary to locate the remaining priests and save Earth. Yay! It's a save Earth mission. Okay, uh, let's look around for a moment and be like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know why. I feel like it's something I'd see in Gears of War. Or, uh, you know, God of War or something. There's a new bar in the top right. I don't know what that is. That's not my flame. My flame is R. R, C, and G. I didn't shoot it. <laughs> Barrel blast. Yep, this is turned into Dark Souls, man. This is two Dark Souls. Oh, there's a one up back there. I almost missed it. Hold on. I'm going to go back. I got to look at my map more often. Yep, there it is. find the uh, the wall climbing mechanics to be a little silly uh, eh. it's the dark souls of doom games well it actually has to be hard we got gargoyles they act like dimps except they fly Right down the middle. Ow. There's your hell demon dog. He's trying to guide me. Come on, Lassie, where are the demons at? I found the infinity gauntlet. Where's Thanos? 
The Infinity Gauntlet has been located. We gotta find the Infinity Stones, guys. Blood Punch. <laughs> blood Punch is a melee attack that deals extra damage. Glory Killing fills the Blood Punch meter. Once charged, press E or mouse forward to unleash it. Blood punch. Oh, shoot, they all exploded. Blood punch. Is that in the bottom left? That's how you can tell? It's, it's hard for me to understand, like. Okay. The counter in the top right, I'm looking at this and I'm trying to figure out what exactly it is. I think that is the amount of uh, hell demons that are in this section of the map. And the max that I can max out on. The more I kill, the more it'll show up. Finish there, I think. Punch. Runes. Runes enhance your abilities or enable new abilities. You have limited rune slots, so choose the runes that fit your playstyle. Oh, so I can unlock under these. <laughs> Perform glory kills faster. Uh, launch into a glory kill from further away. Gain a speed boost after performing a glory kill. Greatly increase movement control while in the air. Okay. Uh, increase how long enemies remain in a staggered state. Uh, survive one death blow and briefly slow down time, giving you a chance to recover. This rune recharges on death. Hold mouse two in midair to temporarily slow down time. Once the rune is fully drained, you'll need to wait for it to recharge. Uh, enemies killed by equipment or while under the influence of equipment will decrease the recharge time. Enemies killed by a blunt punch, shockwave, drop health. Hmm. I think I like uh, performing glory kills from further away. I'll start with that. Seek and destroy. Nice. Thanos is featured in the opening video. Oh, yeah. This is... Uh... Rune tab of the dossier. This is the rune tab of the dossier. Uh, here you can view and equip purchased runes by placing them in available slots. The selected rune is now active. To find you more runes will unlock more rune slots. Swap runes to fit your playstyle. I gotcha. You know what that reminds me of? Uh, you know what? I can't even think of it. I, I know what it is in my mind, but I just can't think of it right now. I can't think of the name. No, I didn't play Diablo 3, so I have no idea. Ooh. I see that. Yay! It's a little Arachnotron. Arachnotron. I was right. It was Arachnotron. I, one thing I do like is while you're shooting enemies, you can watch pieces and parts of them literally rip off. Like, when I was shooting at Hell Knight, 
he, you could see pieces and parts of his flesh just start to rip off all together, and that was beautiful. Anything else I'm missing here? I missed an extra life up there somewhere. You know what? I, I got three extra lives. I'm okay. got an achievement. Darn it, they keep breaking. You can go outside the bounds. I almost died. Got him. Nice. Complete all encounters in the mission to earn weapon points. The demonic corruption meter tracks the points you've earned. Each mission is 10 weapon points in total. Spend weapon points in the arsenal uh, tab in the dossier to upgrade your weapon mods. In the arsenal tab in the dossier here, you can upgrade your weapon mods, upgrade your weapon, uh, customize your weapon wheel, and apply custom skins to weapons. Okay. Custom skins? Oh, God. I got six. Okay. Upgrades and mastery. Launch five sticky bombs before having to reload the mod. Oh, I got you. Okay. Uh, I didn't want to buy that. That's why I was trying to get out of it. I wanted to go back to the other one. Full auto and look at that. But now... I'm... Okay, thanks, game. Um, full auto... Mode recovery speed is increased by 50%. I see, okay. Heavy cannon, precision bolt, um, mobility. It says precision bolt movement speed is increased by 15%. Reload speed is increased by 20%. Okay. We're going to hold off on this. Get some more points. Yeah, I should have I should have thought about the blood punch. That's alright. If I find an, another Rackmatron, I'll try it out and see what happens.
I gotta scroll up to see it, Silva. It's too far gone already. You just said you're loving the hell out of this game already. And Eddie the Beast Hall. No, I already saw that one, Silva. No, I just... I'll have to look it up later, or you'll have to send it to me over uh, Discord in, like, a DM so I can check it out. There's your dog again. Check the auto map frequently to see what you uncovered. I know. trying to watch the stream at 1080 and it looks even better. Oh, I'm supposed to go that way. I went the wrong way. Oh, I see. Okay. So I'm not supposed to go this way? No, I'm supposed to come back this way from that way somehow. Yeah, I don't think I can make it up there. thing of beauty right there sorry if i'm missing things in the chat guys i'm really focused on the game right now and i'm also tired at the same time so i mean we're past wait we're already past the normal time i sleep so give me some leniency I look away for two minutes. And it's the end of the world. No, no, no. Uh, Twitch of Chicago server must have just went down. I didn't eat the server, Joe. I promise. No, no. It wasn't you. It was Twitch. I'm glad I have something on. It should pop up whenever this, whenever I go, uh, whenever there's like net issues or something, it should pop up with like a 90 second video that pops up or something like that to where it's like intermission or technical difficulties or something. So I don't actually lose any viewership or anything. So we just keep going. That's like the best thing that Twitch has added. And <laughs> Doom kills Chicago. Let's over to the New York server. Probably won't be much better, but we'll see.
I hope that comes back down. No, it just opened up something. Okay. Good. Neat. Dash. Use the left ship to quickly move when traversing or fighting. Uh, dash in an pitted surface instantly attaches you to it. You can dash twice before it needs to recharge. Okay. That was in the first game, so that's, that's understandable. Cool. Um, Emperor, I'd like to talk to you for a moment about uh, abusive girlfriends. Hold on. That looks like an easy one to get. Secret found. Video time. All right, I get out of the way. Why are you Despite their transgressions against the Covenant, they are still of sentinel blood. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. It is written. It is their time to give penance. If you continue, you will bring down the Heaven's wrath. You are but one man. They are no longer your people to save. Isn't that nice? They are no longer your people to save. You're, you're trying to tell the Doom guy not to do something. That was your first mistake. It, it gives me a Norse vibe as well. Either Norse or uh, Greek, because I'm thinking uh, I'm thinking Zeus a little bit, you know? I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did, did not, not hit her. her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. All right, see you later, Quavion. You have a good night, dude. Don't worry, I'm probably going to get off here soon as well. Oh, I hit R by accident. I gotta wait for it to recharge. Dude, I love watching their bodies just shred the pieces. That didn't work. Electricity on the ground is bad, okay? Let's see. Activate the transdimensional portal. Oh, okay, so I'm going somewhere else now. Which is this way. Sentinel 
additional battery can be used to provide additional power to your ship. Several modules remain unused. Finding more batteries will enable you to utilize the full functions of your command station. Is this the end of the map? Hold on a second. Uh, yeah, a little bit, Jack. I'm normally, uh, done at midnight, but... You're here before I ended, so... It's not all bad. Sorry, dude. I'm a little tired. I'm already a little wiped out. I can't wait to get back into this tomorrow, though. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'll be more awake and not as tired. Plasma gun! I was looking forward to this ever since I saw the trailer because I was I saw the trailer for Phobos and I'm like, this is the original gun from the original game. Yes. That's all I gotta say is yes. Big point, Revenant. Very similar to how to operate it in the original game. That's awesome. Plasma gun, dude. my whole entire follow list is doom eternal i believe it that's how that's how it is when it comes to when the big games come out man everybody looks forward to it everybody plays it so i could imagine somebody coming into the stream and being like all right everybody playing doom what makes you better than everyone else they don't have my skill. Even when I'm tired, I can still beat them. That's pretty freaking cool. Giant arm. Giant hand. Boop. I guess. This looks like a... I don't know why it reminds me of Iron Man. Is that not doing anything? Listen to the music. That's from the original game. That's from the original game, dude. That's great. Ooh. 
Where the hell is the English accent coming from? I'm using it right now. This is my English. Oh, you mean, you mean British? Oh, you want the British accent? It's absolutely dreadful. Bloody hell. I'm like, don't touch the purple goo. Oh God, man, this is so weird, but so cool at the same time. Oh, there's something, there's tentacles. Tentacles in the water. I can't actually get out, It's I'm stuck. Automatic. Oh, of course, you're gonna put him right there. Meanies. Wait, the health is gone? Okay, I see how it is. We got on heat blast and microwave beam. That looks beautiful, by the way. Look at that blueness. Microwave beam. Hit him with the radiation and watch him explode. Heat blast. Okay. I was expecting it. Oh, yeah, yeah. That is what it is. So you do a certain amount of uh, damage to the enemies and then you hit the switch and it causes it to explode out just like it did in the first game. I want to do microwave beam though, that looks cool. No ammo for it, but man, I'm... There is a sentinel power core nearby. You can use it to activate the mech and clear a path forward. That just goes in my back pocket. Once you get stuck down here, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do to get out. Can it warm up my nuggets? Um, what kind of nuggets are you talking about? The answer is no. Doom's oh my gosh, it's a vinyl record at Doom's Gate. It's a vinyl record. That's pretty freaking cool. Yeah, it's like a uh... Simon Cowell. You know, I'd have to look up Simon Cowell. Not been worried to me at all. Blow it up. Iron Man.
I do like the takes. Uh, I, I just, I love the music. It just brings me back to the original game with the nostalgia. Can you climb up chains? No. Ah, uh, I see you're drawing a line for each one. We've done four, so this will be number five. And then that's it, doors open. Everybody get your pentagrams out. Pray to the blood gods. Can't have one, you gotta have two doors. Not just two, gotta have three. And that looks amazing. Holy crap. Oh, that's Simon Cowell. Okay, now that sounds familiar. I know who you're talking about. Simon from American Idol. I got you. I don't know his last name, but thanks for letting me know. much going on it's hard to keep up with it man plus i'm just so freaking tired right now it's hard for me to keep up with anything gotta be kidding me another one gonna continue this tomorrow guys i am wiped out and i just can't focus there's so much going on on screen it's just throwing me all over the place and i'm just thrown for a loop so i'm gonna continue this tomorrow i think it'd be a good spot for it anyway hell i died you know what we got our first taste of doom eternal and i can't wait to get back into more of it tomorrow it's fun it's great and i'm tired so I think I'm just going to jump straight out.